So th this is um, a very simple prawn souffle recipe, but you can use things like tuna, you could put flaked salmon into it, uh, mackerel, anything. It's a little bit different because you don't have to make a sauce. All you do is you put egg yolk into a, a sort of a medium sized bowl, breadcrumbs. You can add parsley. You can also add some chive to this if you want to for extra flavour. You can also add a little bit of parmesan cheese as well. Uh, today I'm just using parsley, lemon rind and some lemon juice. So you need the juice of half a lemon or alternatively you can add a little bit of milk. Make sure the pips don't go in. And then you just mix all this up together and then you add some prawns. Now these are frozen prawns which have been defrosted. Remove any liquor and stir that in as well. So you've got this sort of bread crummy prawn mix. And then all you do to this is you add some egg white and that's how easy it is to make this little souffle. So get your whisk, whisk your egg whites till they're stiff and then all you do is you mix your egg white mixture in with your prawn and breadcrumb mixture. Just carefully fold it in. Just put a little bit in it to begin with, give it a good stir and then add the remaining, add it to the remaining egg white, like so. And then carefully fold it all up together. And um, this souffle is simple to make. You can sort of prepare, prepare everything, except obviously the egg white last until the last minute. And then you just bake it in the oven for about 18 minutes. But you have to bake it in a bain-marie and a bain-marie is simply a tray like this with some water in it. So half fill your tray with water and then get the souffle dishes that you're using. If you follow the full recipe, which is in Made Magazine, it will make six. I've just actually cut the recipe in half just for demonstration purposes. Pop this souffle mix in but it's it's lovely because you can really I've used frozen defrosted prawns today but you can use tuna you can use bits of salmon so it's a really quick recipe to make and it's just a little bit different to a normal souffle so just get your soufflés pop them in your bain marie that just stops them from getting crusty and then pop this in the oven cook them at about 180 degrees fan it's very light so if you're watching your weight it's a great recipe and it's a really nice hot starter idea for a meal mm -hmm.